Natalie added Prince to the conversation. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? You can add the guy we are trash talking to the group conversation. Hey guys, it's Gabriella, and welcome back to the chat video. I thought today we would do another fun one because things have been getting a little intense on this channel. Secret of Rain. Um, if you haven't seen that video, go watch it. But I thought we would, you know, do something fun. So today we are doing When Sleeping Beauty Wakes Up. Sleeping Beauty has finally been awakened, and of course, the first thing Aurora does is text her bestie Nat about her prince she isn't really into. So, all right. Before we get started, make sure you follow me on all my social media. We have Snapchat, so grab your phone and scan that code. Join the fam and follow us on Instagram, and don't be bitter, follow us on Twitter. All right, let's see what's gonna happen. <gasps> OML, Nat, Nat, you wouldn't believe what just happened. I need you like now. Tell me you're still alive. Yeah, but since when can you text Sleeping Beauty? <laughs> That's the thing. I'm not sleeping anymore. Whoa, so a prince finally came along. <laughs> can you imagine though, like what that'd be like if like one of your friends, like you just knew that she was like, okay, well what happened to uh, Aurora? And she's like, oh, she has to stay asleep until her true love kiss comes and kisses her and wakes her up. <gasps> How'd you know? Uh, everyone knows you covered a tower in vines and invited a dragon to it with a spindle. Everyone knows. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, it's kind of bad. Anyway, what's being alive again like? Okay, but so Aurora didn't do it to herself. The evil queen did. <laughs> Sucky, what's wrong? You're living and you have a guy. That's more than I can say for myself right now. <laughs> RN? It means right now. <laughs> Ugh, text sling changed over the last hundred years. Anyway, things are kind of weird with the guy. Weird? How? I mean, he, like, he isn't my type. But he saved my life and all, so it's not like I can say tough luck, buddy, and kick him to the- He's a prince, for goodness sake, eh? What else do you want? I mean, he's kind of a creep. What kind of guy just kisses a sleeping chick? Chivalry's dead anyway. All things considered, I guess he isn't that bad even still. You could have done way worse. He proposed to me within, like, a week of meeting. What? What did you say? I think about it. Okay, but like, how did he wake her up if he wasn't her true love? What is this? But like, marriage? I mean, I just met this dude. Did that century long nap fry your brain or something? A freaking prince proposed to you and you said no. I can't believe this. I didn't say no. Well, not yet. Were you planning to say no? Maybe. How old is Natalie? Is Natalie like this like 100 year old like just like texting her like best friend who's like 20 still because like she's like magically preserved? I'm very confused about the logistics of this storyline. <laughs> okay, hold up. I know exactly how to fix this. Fix what? Nat, you better not be doing what I think you're doing. I swear to God, Nat, if you do it, Natalie added Prince Will to the conversation. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? You can add the guy we are trash talking to the group conversation. And you did it. You ain't getting past your problems by sitting around texting me. And I will by texting him? <laughs> oh no! What is this conversation? Have fun, guys! Oh my gosh! She's the worst! Um, hey, Philip. I thought you told me you didn't have a phone. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah, this is a new thing. Oh, okay. So, why did your lady in waiting make us text each other? Um, don't scroll up. Too late. <laughs> you know you can say no to my face, right? I know, but like, you saved my life and stuff when you didn't have to? Uh, not really. What? My dad made me battle the dragon thingy to prove my worth or whatever. As for you, I kinda didn't kiss you. You just happened to wake up on your own when I tried CPR. <laughs> Wait, for real? Yeah, and the proposal was my dad's idea. You're attractive, and he has this obsession with having a bloodline of hot grandkids. Oh my gosh. Now I feel like a piece of poop. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't say you're a piece of poop level. Maybe a bit of a meanie, though. A meanie? Yep, and since you were mean, you should really make it up to me. And how can I do that? Take me on a date this weekend? I'd love to. Aww, this is cute. <laughs> Hold up a sec, though. Aurora added Natalie to the conversation. She'll kill me if she doesn't get the inside scoop. She has two thumbs and a pair of eyes. Uh, hi? OMG! OMG! Yes! I 100% told you so, eh? Called it! Aurora left this conversation. 
Well, this is awkward. Prince Philip lost the conversation. Guess it's just me, myself, and I again. <laughs> and that was cute. I loved it. That was fun. But oh my gosh, that'd be the worst if you were like texting your best friend about a crush and then they added that crush to the group chat. Oh my god, I would kill them. But this is super fun. Make sure you check out the other episodes on the screen. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's kind of like a calming cleansing video compared to yesterday's because I don't know about you guys. Actually, I do know because I was reading those comments and you guys were as shook as I was and were as hyped as I was. So this is a good calm down video for us all. So make sure you give this one a big thumbs up. Turn on those notifications because we're posting so many videos and you do not want to miss a single one of them. And I will see you guys around for a brand new video. Bye!